Traders Connect have just released their CTrader integration. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to connect multiple CTrader accounts to the platform. So starting from the dashboard, I'm going to look left to the accounts tab. I'll click that here. And then in the top right, I'll click the add account button. There's going to be a few different platform choices here now. Um, for this video, I'll be going with CTrader, of course, and I'm going to click authenticate. So if you don't come to a page like this, make sure that you're logged in to your CTrader profile in their web application. You have to make sure that you're using the web application and not their desktop application. So here you can see two of my CTrader accounts linked to one of my CTrader profiles. Um, I'll show you how to connect the accounts from a second profile in just a moment. So I'm going to choose the accounts that I want. Generally, it's best to just choose all of them just so that they're all authenticated. And I'm going to click allow access. So you'll be asked to provide a name for your CTrader ID or your CTrader profile so that you can easily identify it later. So I'm just going to call this profile profile one. I'll hit confirm. And now we're going to be easily be able to see all of our profiles on the left once we authenticate them. And we can see in this column here, uh, in this drop down, we can see both of my accounts that I previously authenticated. So I'm just going to choose this account for now and I'll call it account A. I'll hit confirm and the account is connected. So if you want to add accounts from a different CTrader profile, you're first going to want to go to id.ctrader.com, sign out of your first CTrader profile, and then sign into the new CTrader profile with the new accounts that you want to add and authenticate. So I've done that already. I'm going to go up to add account. I'm going to click on CTrader, and then I'm going to click on re-authenticate with this little green button right here. And now these are the accounts from my secondary CTrader ID or CTrader profile. So I'm going to uh, make sure they're all selected so they're all authenticated and I'm going to click allow access. Um, I'll name this profile two for just to keep it simple. And now you can see I've got both profile one, my first CTrader account and profile two, my second CTrader account selected here. Um, so I'm going to add this account and I'll name it account B. And just like that, I've got two accounts connected from two different CTrader profiles. So I hope you found this video useful. If you want to now learn how to set up your trade copier, you can watch this video here. Thank you for watching.